All right, now we're going to create a submit button, and it's in the form tag. So we have the form tag, and then we create the input type equals double quote submit, and then the value will be submit as well, and then we close that, and then the slash form tag to close it so we hit control s to save and we refresh our web browser now we have a submit button so say we want the s on submit to be capitalized we go over to value and we capitalize it save it refresh now the s is capitalized so that is how you create the submit button if you want to just create any type of button with a different value or text on it we'll create another form tag and another input type and the type is button in double quotes and then the value will be click me double quote and we need to close our form tag slash form and we'll save this and now we have a click me tag or click me button So now let's show you how to create a drop down menu. And you guessed it, it's in the form tag. And then we have a select tag that is made. And it's select main equals double quote. We're going to do year double quote close the select name now here is going to be the option value equals an option will be year 2000 and then we close the option value and we type 2000 and then we have to do slash option close the option and then we have to close the select tag first and then we close the form tag so we'll save it now we have a drop down menu and 2000 is in the drop down menu first because that's our first option well it's our only option so far and if you click on the drop down menu, 2000 shows up. So let's create another option. So we'll do the option value tag equals, let's do 1999. Then we do 1999 because that's what we want it to say. Close the option tag. Save it hit refresh and 2000 is still the first option and we hit the arrow down now we can choose between 2000 or 1999 so we click on 1999 and you can put as many options as you would like in there so we could create another one we'll do that real quick so option value equals 1998 and 1998 is what we want in there. And option, what was the option tag? Save it, refresh, 2000s in there first. And we want to change it to 1998. So here's our option of 2000, 1999, or 1998. We'll click on 1998. So you have learned how to create a submit button.
can change value and submit then you learned how to create just a normal button and you can change the words in there and actually let's show that real quick so this click me button let's say we want it to say I don't know um, insert so in the value we'll type insert we'll save that refresh and now the button says insert you can have it say whatever you want you can even make it say your name so if you want John Smith save it refresh and there's John Smith in the button so as I was saying you you learned how to create a submit button then button that has any value and then you learned how to create a drop down menu and it has three options here but you can have as many options as you, as you would like